Hey guys, welcome back to another episode of Guitar of the Day. I'm your host, Michael Lemo. Uh, so it's Weird Ass Wednesday, which is really turning into Jazz Master <laughs> Wednesday. <laughs> but we're getting so many cool ones and I can't help myself. What do you want me to do? Like just say no? No, I can't do that. <laughs> I love them too much. So uh, today we, Norm picked up something from the, the Dallas Guitar Show that you probably saw if you watched our video of when the truck arrived. And then they made fun of me that I would want it so bad, and it's true. But I know it's going to go fast, so uh, come check it out. So this is a 1959 Fender Jazzmaster. <laughs> what? The gold anodized guard? So, Jazzmasters from 1958 to 1980. So this is... Right in the beginning. So they introduced the Jazzmaster um, at the NAMM show in 1958, and it was supposed to be obviously something different, which it was uh, with the curves of the guitar. It was kind of like a car at the time. A um, little uh, checking here. but uh, So they introduced it, and it uh, did not hit it off with the jazz players as they thought it would, which probably because those guys were used to playing at such big hollow bodies and arch tops, and they still kind of dominate to this day. But it did hit it off with the surf guitar players because of this tremolo. And this was supposed to be kind of like a super strat at the time. Um, so this was looking to go forward from the strat. Um, next step. So um, obviously people, the strat and the telly will always stick around. But it's got the soapbox pickups, which gives you that warm tone, that classic anodized guard. They switched to the tour to shell guard uh, in later of 59 and so this is kind of this is so cool it's aluminum I mean the other one's like a three ply tortoise shell which you uh, normally see um, and then you got the amber switch top which is awesome and then the classic rhythm selector um, one thing that was changed on this guitar it was refret it's a refret uh, but great frets you were probably gonna have to do it at some point anyway so I mean, if that turns you off, then you're not looking to play this guitar, so. <laughs> um, but uh, amazing neck, um, and it's a slap, slap board uh, rosewood neck, as you can see. Um, one of the few years they were doing that. Um, the bolt-on neck, uh, 25 and a half inch scale, um, and just, just an overall unbelievable guitar. When this came in, I was obviously drooling, so you might have a little bit of that on here. <laughs> Ooh, <laughs> too bad. <laughs> but uh, no, just a just an overall. You know, I can't I can't say enough about it. But um, first time playing a '50s jazz master for me. So uh, let's take it out front and see what this thing can do. All right, Jen. Okay. Cool. <laughs> cool, let's Finally. Do it. All right, we're out front with the 1959 Fender Jazz Master. Uh, we're going through a magnetone, all the cues at noon, a little bit of verb, and later we're gonna. Put it into hyperdrive with this Pen Pinnacle Deluxe uh, by Wampler. So uh, uh, I'll let you know when we click it. You'll know. <laughs> so here we go. Starting off uh, with that uh, rhythm selector. Here we go. Next we're going to do uh, just the neck pickup alone, a little Van Halen, different way.
now we're going to hit it into uh, some overdrive just to show you that the Jazzmaster can uh, also cover the other side of things. So here we go. <laughs> least uh, we're gonna do bridge pickup wide open and we're also gonna do drop D. <laughs> Fender Jazzmaster here at Norman's Rare Guitars. You can find these guitars at normansrareguitars.com and on Instagram and Facebook at Norman's Rare Guitars. I'm your host, Michael Lemo, and we will see you tomorrow for a Thumpin' Thursday. Bye. That was awesome.